Hi, my name's Aisha. Today I'm going to show you how to use iron on vinyl with your Cricut hat press. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to Hobbycraft and click the bell icon to be notified of new videos. For this project, you will need Cricut hat press and form, Cricut Joy, a hat, a selection of Cricut Joy Smart Iron on vinyls, strong grip heat resistant tape, Cricut tools, we've used the scissors, scraper and weeding tool, lint roller. You'll also need a laptop, desktop, tablet or mobile device with the Cricut Design Space app installed. Start by creating a project in the Cricut Design Space app. If you'd like to recreate the project we're doing, use the link included in the description below. Add the images to the canvas in the Cricut Design Space app. Measure the area on the hat that you would like the design to cover. Use these measurements to resize and arrange the design on the canvas. Once happy, click Make It. Once through to the map preview screen, check the mirror function is enabled, then click Continue. On the machine setup screen, select the relevant material settings. Feed the iron on vinyl into the machine, then follow the on-screen instructions to begin the cut. Once the cut is complete, use scissors to trim away the excess vinyl. Then use a weeder tool to remove any pieces of the design you do not wish to transfer to the hat. Snip into the vinyl carrier sheet around the design to enable it to bend around the curve of the hat. Power on the hat press and use the Cricut Heat app to determine the best settings for the machine. When the hat press has reached temperature, the power button will turn green and a beep will sound. Place the hat onto the form. Use a lint roller to remove any small pieces of dust that may have become attached to the hat. Place the weeded design onto the hat using purple strong grip heat resistant tape on all the edges. This ensures the design remains in place. Follow the on-screen instructions to press the design, preheating the hat as directed. Ensure as much of the design is covered as possible. Once the timer is complete, a beep will sound. Place the Cricut hat press back into the cradle. Use the scraper tool to ensure the design is adhered to the hat. Peel the carrier sheet away to reveal the design. Add any additional layers of iron-on to the hat using the same method. Your hat is then complete. Thanks for joining me for this video. Go to hobbycraft.co.uk to book a workshop, find your next craft project or learn a new skill. If you found this video useful, leave a like and a comment below as we love to see them. See you again soon for more videos.